Spirit. Lord God, we thank you for the gift of today. We thank you for the gift of our level 100 students. We ask that you be with us so that today's ceremony will be to the greater glory of your name. We make our prayers to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Please take your seats. Greetings, distinguished ladies and gentlemen. I welcome you all to this afternoon's event on behalf of management of St. Louis College of Education. We have convened here this afternoon to matriculate students who have enrolled in Bachelor of Education degree programs here at St. Louis College of Education, which is affiliated to the University of Education, Winneba, for the 2021-2022 academic year. We shall be sold membership in the St. Louis College of Education community in these new students as persons in statu populari. Thus is consistent with Statute 31 of the Harmonized Statute for Colleges of Education, which states, I quote, a person enrolling in the college for the first time shall be matriculated. A person shall not matriculate into the college unless that person has fulfilled the conditions prescribed by the academic board and has been accepted for admission. Thirdly, the academic board shall determine the manner of matriculation into the college." Unquote. The ceremony is divided into three sessions. Part one will feature an address by the principal, 
Part two consists of students taking the matriculation oath, which will be moderated by the Dean of Students Affairs. Students will be matriculated by the Vice Chancellor of UEW or his representative. Following the completion of the ceremony, students will sign the matriculation oath. Professor Dundee, rep of the VC of UEW, since their arrival on campus about three weeks ago, those cohorts of new students have already completed administrative procedures. A heartfelt appreciation to staff at all levels for their contributions to the process of getting students settled in the college. 2021-2022 matriculation class. I look forward to seeing positive engagement in college activities throughout your four year stay in the college. Welcome to St. Louis College of Education. On that remark, I pronounce the matriculation ceremony duly opened. The director, ITEC PD, rep from UEW, distinguished invited guest, vice principal, management, members of staff, student representative council, matriculants, the press, Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to welcome everyone to today's matriculation ceremony, which marks the third batch of St. Louis College of Education students to be admitted to the University of Education, Winneba. We have assembled here to formally welcome you, our freshers, into our fold to pursue a four-year Bachelor of Education degree in various disciplines, as has been the practice of higher education institutions. This ceremony is the formal process of gaining admission to a university or college, and in this case, St. Louis College of Education, by meeting specific academic standards. Matriculation implies that one has met the essential admission qualifications as well as rigorously adhere to all the requisite financial obligations that normally accompany it. Matriculation entails a pledge to uphold institutional norms and regulations. It also provides students with access to the college's services and facilities, as well as rights and benefits. Significantly, it allows students to swear their loyalty to the authority of the college by the delivery of their matriculation oath. And you will be requested to sign a bond to be of good behavior and to submit to the authority of everyone in whom authority has been placed in due process. You will also be expected to do your fair share to improving the image of the college everywhere you go and to avoid bringing the college into this honor. The total number of students admitted is 497. The breakdown of courses or program are as follows. Early grade, we had 188 students. Then upper primary, we had 202. For JHS, uh, JHS education, we have 107, of which 
we have 57 for languages and then 50 for home economics. I congratulate you, my dear matriculants, on your acceptance into our wonderful Slovsan family. It is critical that you prepare yourself for hard academic work. Keep in mind that you are pursuing a degree program that necessitates your undivided focus if you are determined to excel. The courses you'll be studying and the amount of critical knowledge you are required to absorb in the next four years does not provide you the luxury of time. Your major reason for being here is to study, and I strongly advise you to focus on your studies. Be aware that your predecessors, that is the level 200 group, have established a high academic accomplishment that you must keep to or exceed. A casual examination of their level 100 results reveals that Around 60 students are in the first class category, with 300 plus in the second upper class division. The results of the level 300 students are equally very promising. Keep in mind that you were admitted as an individual and you will graduate as an individual. As a result, you are personally accountable for all your actions. I'm very positive that you all are well conditioned for tertiary work. Attach the needed seriousness to your studies and co-curricular activities and victory shall surely be yours. We will be there to guide you as tutors, hall tutors and counselors as long as you are willing to be guided. We will provide you with all essential assistance, but only if you request assistance through appropriate avenues. Remember to read official announcements and follow all the college's rules and regulations as outlined in the student's handbook. When you reported, you went through orientation. But let me remind you that COVID-19 is real. You are required to properly follow all protocols in order to safeguard yourself and your colleagues. Congratulations on securing a spot in St. Louis College of Education. On behalf of the college administration, members of convo convocation, I'm completely confident in your ability to complete the program successfully. Enjoy your time here and take advantage of every opportunity available to improve yourself and prepare for your future vocations and life. Wherever you are, whatever you do, whatever you say, remember that you are ambassadors of St. Louis College of Education. Congratulations and thank you. God bless us all. We now proceed to administer the matriculation oath by programs. May I request the Dean of Students to present the students to be matriculated. Will all students admitted for four-year Bachelor of Education in early grade education stand up to be matriculated? Will all students admitted for four-year Bachelor of Education in upper primary education stand up to be matriculated? Will all students admitted for four-year Bachelor of Education in JHS education stand up to be matriculated?
swearing of matriculation oath and declaration of obedience by students. Students repeat the following after me. I, I do solemnly promise to be a loyal member of St. Louis College of Education to study diligently to be respectful to both staff and students and to conform to all statutes regulations and rules of the college and so far as they concern me so help me God On my singular Anna, I would like to invite the representative of the Vice Chancellor of UEW, Professor George Dandy Sampson, to deliver his address. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, please, uh, the name is not Sampson, it's Damson. Damson. All right, thank you very much, uh, College Registrar. I hope that in the future you give birth and you name him Samson. Madam Principal, St. Louis College of Education, Vice Principal, College Registrar, College Accountant, Dean of Students, Heads of Department, Members of Convocation, Distinguished Guests, SLC President and Reps, my dear students, good afternoon. On behalf of the Vice Chancellor of University of Education, Winneba, and on my own behalf, I warmly welcome you all to this year's matriculation ceremony. I am indeed happy to welcome you as first year student 
admitted into various Bachelor of Education programs in this noble College of Education affiliated to University of Education, Winneba. I congratulate you for gaining admission into St. Louis College of Education. Distinguished guests, for the past two years, University of Education Winneba has been partnering and mentoring St. Louis College of Education to train quality and professional teachers. I am happy to place on record that our partnership and mentorship has been very cooperative and productive over the years and we have the trust of each other. Madam Principal, University of Education Winneba is the leading university in Ghana that is fully committed to the development of human resource needs of our educational institutions. And we are resolved to ensure that we continue to achieve this mission of training high caliber of teachers and educational administrators in partnership with St. Louis College of Education. Madam Principal, I wish to assure the college management, teaching staff and non-teaching staff, as well as the student body, that University of Education Winneba is fully committed to its mandate of mentoring the 15 colleges of education affiliated to University of Education, of which St. Louis is one of them. We will continue to assist, train, and retrain, mentor, and guide, as well as pro provide you all productive suggestions to enable this college compete with the rest of the colleges of education in Ghana and beyond. It is my hope to see in the near future the introduction of market-driven programs in this college so as to enable us to admit more students into more educational programs. To the staff of St. Louis College of Education, I wish to assure you that ITEC PD is working around the clock to send the results of the first badge of your promotions to GTEC by close of work next week to certify and facilitate your promotion for which is long overdue. This is done because there are no councils in the place as to satisfy your promotion. So many things went into the processes, which is why there has been a delay. However, the green light has been given. Keep supporting the principal and the management with integrity and commitment. To the student, my dear matriculants, as you may be aware, you are now students of both St. Louis College of Education and University of Education, Winneba. I wish I were you. The programs you have been admitted into is intensive and practical oriented, and therefore you will only achieve success through discipline and commitment. I will therefore urge all of you here today to plan in line with the nature of the academic calendar for the colleges of education. And most importantly, I urge you to have focus to pursue your chosen programs, considering the limited time at your disposal. I will plead and entreat all of you here today to be abreast with the ENTEP, that is the National Teacher Education Assessment Policy, which is the main guideline and yardstick for your assessment. Complete all assignments and submit them on time. Work in groups, but spend quality time on your own studies by yourself. In conclusion, I wish to state that the University of Education Winneba is committed to the mentoring process for which we are mandated to do, and we will strive to sustain and improve the quality of education in our noble colleges of education, of which St. Louis is our prime target. On behalf of the Vice Chancellor of University of Education, and the management of UEW, I would like to wish you a successful stay at St. Louis College of Education. Thank you. Thank you, Professor Damson.
Will all students be upstanding? Professor Damson, representative for Vice Chancellor of UEW, I present to you the matriculants who have duly taken the matriculation oath. I pray you to matriculate them. Thank you very much, uh, College Registrar. By the powers in me vested, I do hereby matriculate all of you here present today, admitting you to the rights, privileges, and responsibilities of University of Education, Winneba. Congratulations. Shall we also stand for the closing prayer? We pray in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Not to us, O Lord, not to us, but your name we give the glory for what we have seen or witnessed today, for the love shown to us, and for the privilege given to your deltas to be trained, nurtured, and formed as professional teachers some years to come. We pray you that the purpose of which you brought these, your daughters, may be attained through the guidance we give to them. We thank you for your traveling mercies. Again, we pray that as we are about to go to the various places we came from, you be with us and protect us. And again, we ask you to bless the St. Louis College community members, UW, that the purpose for which we have come together as one people, by your grace, we will attain. Bless us today, bless us tomorrow, and let us remain in your blessing every day. We make our prayer to your Son, Jesus Christ, who is Lord forever and ever. Amen. Please take your seat. Please be upstanding. Please, sorry, be upstanding. Assembly for matriculation ceremony is now dissolved. Shall we all please stand for recession?